So who here has been playing a lot of Overwatch this summer? Well, I know that my friends and I certainly have been a little too much. Now, one of my friends lives in Colorado and it's a pretty hot summer and he doesn't have air conditioning. It's like 85 degrees in his apartment and his little S3 is cooking. This is also because Overwatch runs so freaking hot. I don't know why it does that. I'm not a game programmer, but I am a modder and I can fix his problem. Play of the game. Please, don't move. So I went on to Amazon and I purchased a box with stuff in it. This is actually an Amazon Basics product. It is a monitor stand, something that um, is very cheap to find. And there's uh, all sorts of variety of them, but I wanted something that was pretty simple that the S3 Mini or S4 could fit right underneath in between the two legs and was just simple sheet metal. And my plan is to cut out two holes and attach some fans that I purchased. Now, that's all well and good, but it's not gonna be very useful until we can power them. So I'm going to wire the fans up in parallel, and I am going to attach this adapter to it. So my friend just has to plug this into a wall, the fans will spin, he can put the S3 Mini underneath the device, or he's gonna be able to flip the fans around and put the S4 Mini on top which won't cool as well, but will cool his laptop if he has wants to do it that way. So, uh, very simple mod, just gotta put some holes in it. a 12 volt power supply with alligator clips on the end and it allows you to quickly test things like LEDs and comes in very handy for testing our fans using my handy dandy wire strippers. You can almost do this with your eyes closed. Be smart and I'm going to test my power brick and see if it actually works. And look at that, it is spinning. See if it strips two at a time. This is the greatest wire stripper known to man. Buy one. And uh, please use my link in the description so I get like 12 cents. Rosencore solder smoke. Don't breathe this.
want a popsicle?